So the first evolution without a single requirement apart from an overall rating. So max 88 overall. Any single card that's 88 and below is eligible for this Evo. And the boost by the looks of it is a plus one to the pace, the shooting, plus two to the passing, plus two to dribbling, plus one to defending, a plus one to physical. So pretty well rounded. It is free as well. You get no playstyle plus, which is a bit disappointing. But you can use two Playstyle Plus cards for this Evo. For cheap and fast FC24 Ultimate Team Coins, head over to MMOEXP.com, link down below, and make sure to use my code Morsi at checkout to get yourself 5% off. So looking in the team, I'm set oh, Vieira instantly pops up. There's some potential here, for sure. Like, and there's a lot of very good 88 rated and below cards on the game right now. Vieira, for one, instantly give him a nice little boost, which is... Uh, it's not like crazy, obviously, on paper, but that is a fine tune and a half. I've got Vitinha here, the team of the week that looks pretty crazy. 91 passing, 95 dribbling. Deli Ali. This lady, I can't say her name. I'm going to butcher it, so I'm not even going to attempt it. Jude Bellingham, player of the month as well. So there's a lot of variety here. Big Raheem Sterling. Like 91 pace, 90 shooting, 91 dribbling. I would definitely say off the bat, before like taking a deep dive here, is look for cards with maybe two playstyle pluses. And kind of like go off that. Potential Evo chains as well. If you've got 88 rated or lower. Maybe ones like Marlon. Hold up. Is that? It was the 89 rated. I can't remember. Marlon had a special card. That was uh, I think it was 88 or 89 rated. One of the Evos. One of the finisher Evos. He was insane. Uh, there's a lot of crazy options here. I'm secretly hoping. Hold up. Whoa. Team of the week CR7 is eligible. 92 shooting, 86 dribbling, 86 passing. 5 star, 4 star. We don't get a playstyle plus. That's the, the real letdown here. But that's a nice little card for sure if you've packed that untradeable like I have. Taliska as well. We saw Ramos in here. Kamara as well. Let's have a little look at this lad real quick. I mean, it's a nice little juice to be fair here. But I still probably would not be using this Evo on a player like this. Uh, I, what, one thing I will say as well, unless you've got a completely standout card, hold up. Salmon. Salmon's stats are going to be bonkers, by the way. Look at the state of this card. She's medium, medium, which isn't great. But four star, five star. Those stats are insane. 99 ball control, 99 balance. Crazy finishing. If only it gave like a finesse shot or technical play style plus as well. Stamina is too low, though, unfortunately. But that's a crazy card on paper. I'm pretty certain I just saw Big William Saliba, the honourable mention one as well. Another Evo for my favourite centre-back. Nice little boost. I think I've got the two playstyle version. That's the issue. There's, there's other versions out there of Saliba that are probably going to be better than this man. But if you are still rocking the honourable mention Saliba, this must be a no-brainer because Anticipate and some crazy nice little stats. Shame about the card design. If only they'd given it a Galazzo theme. Keen, even Sergio Gomez eligible. Kola Mawani as well. This Evo definitely has potential. I think it's going to be one of those where it's going to be unique to you, the players that you use, because you've got to look and scan through your club to see if there's any crazy cards already lurking that maybe might be a bit outdated. That's probably what I would be looking for if I was you guys. But let me load up for GG and have a little look to see if there's any standouts that are blaringly obvious. Gwendozi, Obama Yang with 93 shooting, no, 90 shooting, 93 pace, looks pretty decent there. So, but is that, I think that's an original Evo, isn't it? The, uh, the Future Star Academy. Kone. I saw a crazy Evo with this man the other day. Uh, a few of you guys sent me it in the Discord. So that guy, that card looked insane. Cristiano Ronaldo at the top looking like the standout player for sure. Whoa, 99 shooting. Honorat. Of course you can chain this with the 99 shooting Evo, can't you? I wonder if that produces any absolute demons. Kola Mawani. I think that's the FC Pro version there. Um, one thing I was going to say as well with this Evo, because there's no requirements, it's probably a good Evo to maybe save, hang fire and see if you can chain it with potential ones. Because as long as they're 88 rated and below, no matter the stats, you're going to get a nice fine tuning. So there could be an option where they maybe drop another 99 shooting evolution and then you're able to just chuck in any card you fancy. Cole Palmer, that's a chain, right? Oh, okay, it's the Chucky Ricardo. Five star, five star, medium, medium. Probably not worth the hassle because that's a big commitment, but it's a nice option, I guess. Uh, there's definitely some chain ability factor here for sure. Grimaldo, the center mid, looks decent. I think Vieira. Whoa, hold up. What is this? Wow. <laughs> Look at the play styles. 
How many play styles does she need, man? I mean, you can't see the shooting, but it's, it's 99s across the board there. This card is crazy. I mean, links are going to be tough for sure. She's only 5'3", but I mean, just mental on paper. That Schweiger 99 shooting there looks pretty crazy as well. Uh, any other absolute demons on this page? I think our best shout, to be fair, as it's been a little while since content, is to head over to Footbin and have a look at the trending options. Um, I've been reviewing, by the way. That's why this has been a little bit delayed. I've been checking out Viali, Cantona, uh, also Jogba, and I have Pat Jarzinho. So let me know if you want to review on that one. Um, so Ronaldo, David Neres, Mendy is trending. Hold up. I see a Marlon as well. So David Neres is a, uh, a chain here. Jack of all trades, Club Nightmare shooting. That's a ridiculous card. A five star, five star. Medium lows, are, oh, it's medium, medium. It's a bit dead, but it doesn't matter when you've got stats like this. Like, that is absolutely disgusting. And I know a fair few of you guys probably did this jack of all trades option. So there you go. A nice little fine tune to chuck on top. Ronaldo, we checked out. Mendy, I'm not sure what version you're evoing here. It's the Centurion. How expensive is this card, though? It must be crazy still, right? 600k. I mean, it's a nice little boost considering it's already a mad card. And I know a few of you guys out there are going to have that card untradeable already. We looked at Saliba. Big Marlon now. 88 rated Don Yao. Is this the... Uh, okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. He's back. Five star, four star. Rapid. Finesse shot. Club 99 shooting into the birthday magic. Into the unleashing potential. That might be one of the best ones, you know. The stats look insane, and he's always overpowered. He had that crazy version a few uh, a few months back. Hudson Adoy, you know what? I reviewed this guy. Someone in my comments said to me, "There's a reason they're making him 88 rated. He's gonna fit in an Evo." Can you see into the future, my son? Because he can, and he looks even better now. Five star, four star, great play styles, brilliant pace, shooting, dribbling as well. He might be one of the better ones. Of course, composure not great, and reactions not great, but. I enjoyed him yesterday. That review's on the channel. If you want to check it out, I thought he was decent. Uh, Marquez, Eda Militao, that other Evos. Di Natale. Is this man going to get a special card, by the way? Like, five-star, five-star Di Natale. That basically is like a promo version of him. But surely, he is due an upgrade. Did they do this last year with him as well? I seem to remember this man does not get an upgrade at all. I saw he had basically every hero some sort of promo card. Di Natale, not there yet. But that's a nice alleyway to get uh, a nice Evo for Di Natale if you want to go about that way. So there's some nice options for sure. Hold up. Hold up. Kyle. Is this some sort of chain? Keeping balance. I think I've got this on my RTG, you know. It's a nice boost. Probably not worth it though. I think this Evo is probably better off used elsewhere. I think that's the Trailblazer Ronaldo, isn't it? So there's a few Ronaldo versions. Yaya Torre eligible as well. Okay, EA. So I like the, the process here. I like the idea of this one. Because this triple threat is still usable, but probably a bit outdated. Especially with the fantasy card. But this kind of brings him back into, you know, usable. Wait, this was already usable. But it gives him a nice little boost to make him even more usable. Rashford in there as well. 91 pace, 99 shooting. I like that. That was the uh, the Marlon Evo I was thinking about. So he doesn't quite fit it, unfortunately. Camavinga, that Camavinga. Whoa, hold up. Sorry, guys. Going off uh, off track here. Okay, so it's a big it's a big grind. But that is ridiculous. If you can get to that Camavinga, GG's in the chat, get it done for sure. That's a crazy looking card. Ramirez eligible as well. I like that. I'm a Hodzic also. Ribery. There's some really good options in here. Peter Crouch was up to an 89 if you didn't do the other Evo for him. Oh, Smith Rowe, call my eye there. At least your potential on this man. I'm pretty certain I've got. Okay. I've got this card. I swear I do. I have a version. Oh, I might be higher rated. Might be higher rated. But that's a mad Shobosly. So there's some really nice chains here. And some potential for sure. I will say, I don't think there's any real standout must-do Evo here, which is what I like. I think it's going to be very club dependent. I wouldn't go out and buy cards for this evolution. That would be silly. Because you're just wasting coins at that point. Use your club. Utilize your club. See what you've got. I definitely don't rush into it. Keep hold of what you can have because potential to chain down the line could be crazy. For me, I think it's probably going to be Salmon anyway. 
Salmon looks like the, probably the, uh, the best one in my opinion. If you've got this Saliba, definitely consider it for sure because he's a unit. This 88 alone is fantastic. Going up to an 89 would be even better. But yeah, nice evolution. Potential's there for sure. Don't rush into it. Hang fire, see if potential chains can come out. But anyway, let me know who you're going to do. If you are going to commit to somebody, I'll be more see subscribing to you. Catch you guys later.